Okay, guys, this is vlog number eight. And this one is <coughs> entitled What I've Learned from My Two Domestic Abuse Relationships. So, as you know, I was in two very bad abuse of flight. My first one was my ex, my now ex husband, and the second one was the brother that I met when I was with me now, my ex husband. Um, but <laughs> I've always met after a bit, I've sort of, um, as actually anyone that's been in a abusive relationship, I've, I've just heard, you know, you think, oh, you know, well, oh, it, oh, perhaps it was me, perhaps I did something wrong, and then obviously, but I did quickly realise that no, it wasn't me, it wasn't, it wasn't my fault at all, and it was, it was all him. Even though he, my no ex has been actually blaming me for them um, drinking and that, I mean, I didn't, it's not like, I, I I held the gun to present, so you, you must drink this kind of beer. Nothing like that. It's, um, so yeah, I've, I've learned that. It, none of it was my fault. None of it was my fault. None of it was my fault. <coughs> it was all them. Um, I've also learned that I'm stronger than what I thought. <laughs> it's, I mean, yeah, it, obviously it took me a while um, to get through, but... <coughs> Well, as I'm actually a stronger person than I actually thought I was. Um, and I've also learned... <coughs> excuse me. I've also learned that um, I can actually... I'm actually able to... Um, I can stand up for myself now. I, I don't accept any of that kind of behaviour anymore. I know, um, and I know what to look, what the signs to look for. Um, and obviously, as I probably met the worst uh, degree of control in both of them. My ex husband, my now ex husband, it was financial control. So basically, um, because it, it <coughs> for a time, um, maybe out there, <coughs> it was beginning of the day, but we, we just had, um, out some which is the oldest of our two children. Um, so obviously we had child benefit and that. And at first he was have like in like a book. Um, where you'd, you'd have like sort of like a check type thing in it and you maybe announce it and you step that to the post office, cash it, and they'd um, give us the money and the milk token. And then we went to um, Gyros. I don't know if any of you remember them, I've gone back years. Um, and then obviously they started with bank account, which I didn't have a bank account because um, I lost my bank account, but I cashed out the last little bit what was in my bank account that my mum had to set up. Um, so I had to have my money going into my now ex husband's post office account for a time until I could get my own, post get my own bank account. Um, so basically, well, I, it was like being a kid again and I've been um, spending it. So, like, <laughs> for instance, if I wanted, um, I don't know, some toiletries or I needed sanitary products, that type of thing, I used to have to ask him for the money. That's what it was like. Um, and it was also like if I, if I wanted to go and meet my mum in town centre or, you know, go for a coffee, go around shop sort of thing. He wants to know how long we're going to be. Same with other one, if I went out to my room with that. Like, it was the second one. I mean, I was chilling with like 10 minutes walk away from my room with dad. Um, and it's... It, it, well, I used to try and spend at least an hour. You know, when you go to your parents, you want to, you know, it's best to relax and have a bit of time with them. And uh, he used to like, he'd text me. And he went, oh, how long are you going to be? I'll just use them on him, be honest. And he just, um, but I will be doing, look, he needs to look out for this, I will be doing. Um, it won't be a, a vlog or such, but just nine signs that you may be in a controlling relationship, which I, I thought I would, I would, <laughs> I mean, I've, I've, I've gone on to go to get uh, some, but I've, <coughs> I've, I've been also looked at, you know, this art, like, you know, like, it's, well, it's now how long will we have got somewhere, you know, how long, how long you're going to be, and that, blah, blah, blah. Um, <coughs> but yes, I've, I've, I don't 
put up with that kind of behaviour at the minute, unfortunately, I've not done him any more, what I've been like that, but, um, so, yeah, I've, I've learned that I'm a lot stronger, as I said, I've learned that I'm a lot stronger, um, I've learned, obviously, that it wasn't, yeah, my fault, um, and, I just, generally, I've learned that, um, I can actually, um, get through things like this, I'm, I'm a, strongly, I've come out a lot stronger person, um, than I was, um, make, I've built my confidence back up, I've had to do that a couple of times, so I've got, me, I've lost a lot of my confidence for me now, it's just been built it back up, and lost it again with the second one, so it's built it back up again, um, so yeah, I've, I've, I've come out a stronger person. Um, the other things I've learned, obviously, I've learned that um, I've just, it's, yeah, just been a stronger person and I can I now stand up for myself. Um, I won't tolerate any kind of control of me or anything like that. I won't tolerate it at all. Um, as I've said, if it's a, um, obviously if we were meant to, if we were meant to come, meant to be controlled, we'd come with remote control, we mess up, which we don't, so, um, <coughs> I've also obviously learned that, um, obviously mental, <laughs> it's still, it's still, if the, you know, when they, uh, but where, my, not my, the, <coughs> the other one, you know, the mental spots, but they, that is, it is mental a bit when I, I think it wasn't, it wasn't my but it, it is actually uh, properly classed as mental a bit, which, um, is now that they do, <laughs> now I've actually acknowledged that with domestic abuse, whereas before it was just, um, <laughs> mostly with the, the violent side of it, and obviously, but, yeah, things have, they're slowly improving with that, but it's, it's, Still, I mean, it's um, a bit <laughs> to work with. Really. I mean, I, I mean, I, I didn't perform plays when I was, I was just, I suppose, I was scared. Um, but I've learned <coughs> so about I me mean, now. If, 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 if obviously, I mean, I, I know that if it happened, I would, I would literally be up there be the first bit I would that I'd burn up straight away. And yeah, just because I had with me. Um, especially when I wake up, because I, I did a different <coughs> first time. I would just had we just I just had my son. The second time we had, um, we just got our daughter because me, um, our son was is um was living with his auntie and uncles at the time. I don't end up going to daytime, but that's where he was living. Um, but so yeah, I was obviously worried that they'd take my daughter away, um, but yeah, so that's basically what I've learned, and that's how I'm just, I am a lot stronger person now, I mean, I know, I'm a survivor, um, so yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's something that I wouldn't want to go through it again, it's, um, but I, I know now, you know, I've learnt what to look for. Um, then you know, I can. I am stronger than I thought. I can. I, I can. Nasty, I can stand up for myself now. I'm a lot confident. I wouldn't. I would literally not upset. They would literally be out the door. Or they'd be out the door in cat and cuffs. I wouldn't tolerate it anymore. Um. So yeah. <laughs> um, I'm not going to rattle on for much longer because I don't want to. I don't want really to bother you to death. But yeah, that's uh, the main things I've learned from the two bad relationships. So, um, yeah, I well, hope you, um, obviously, if, if any of if you are in a, you have, you are in, or you have been in a domestic abuse, obviously, um, like, at least, let's, if, whether it's a family member or whether it's a, let somebody know. I've, you know, I've something to take for your support, you know, to talk to, um, 
And yeah, that's <laughs> time just get out by you when you can. As soon as you can, don't you don't? I know it's I know it's hard. Trust me, I'm that it is hard, but it is. <coughs> it, it will never it will never get better. You will face that to well. Oh no, it'll never happen again. No, don't upset that. Do not upset that. It, it is. Um, I've been afraid that no end of the of the of the abs. Oh, I'll never do that. Yeah. <laughs> Until the next time, and the time after that, and the time after that. So don't upset if if that's what I said. No. As as soon as, uh, <laughs> at the moment they him or her, because obviously I know meant it does happen to men. The moment him or her lay a hand on you in any other way, except giving you a cuddle or. Or something like that. <coughs> Just find the place. Get out where you can. Just get out of it will, it, will, it will not get better. It will get worse. <coughs> so. Yeah. <laughs> That's all the best. That's what I want to set up. Um, I was set <coughs> with a, a bad mental bit. You know. They started. Um, you know. They, they're bringing you down. Lot, you know, they're trying to belittle you, making you feel this big. Again, get out because it, it, <coughs> Wait, we'll just get, start with my. Um, I mean, I, I tried to, he just, he basically just, he, I don't think he even thought he was doing anything wrong. He just, it was just like one big game to him. Um, but it's that, it's. I think with some of them, I think, you know, this ought to, it makes them. Feel better when they're making you feel that big. When they make you feel that big, it makes them feel that big. So yeah, just um, yeah, just be careful, guys. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna end the video work so I'm repeating myself again. So um, hope you enjoyed the vlog, and thank you again for the support. So bye.